All right, I'm converting this uh, 18 horse Kawasaki V twin engine overhead valve. It was vertical shaft. I'm converting it to horizontal shaft, and uh, so I gotta make a right angle, right angle mounting uh, manifold for the carburetor and I already plugged up the one of the oil fill holes and I'm gonna make a dipper on the crank to get extra oil up in there but these have an oil pump so normally Normally they suck oil from it sucks oil from down in this hole. See that? There's a little hole down in there. And it pulls it from the from the bottom where the bottom seal is down in there. So if I turn it this way, that's not going to work anymore because the oil level is going to be somewhere down here. I'm going to make it where this drain hole is, so it's going to be about this line. So it wouldn't suck up there anymore, so I'm, I drilled the hole. I'm going to plug up that other hole, and I drilled a new hole down here, and I'm going to JB weld in this tube so it, to make sure it sucks up good and this little filter thing goes here and that should I think that should work probably not going to use the governor or Yeah, we'll see how that goes. If it burns up, I'll let you know. I think I might make a, like a Morgan, a mini Morgan three-wheeler, like go-kart size. And so I'm probably going to run without the cooling shroud on it. And I think it'll be okay, because really the shroud's only for if you're going slow and this is going to be right out front and lots of wind on it and everything so I think it'll be good I'll watch the temperature and see if it's overheating but most motorcycles run without all motorcycles run without cooling shrouds and everything so yep that's my little plan Probably gonna keep the electric start and make a a little uh, a cup on the flywheel for like a hand crank start. And that's what I'm working on now. I've also been working on this four wheeler. It's a 90, it was a 90cc Culpin, just a Chinese piece of crap, had like a scooter engine on it, it didn't run good or anything, so I put this Briggs Raptor engine on it, and uh, to do that I just welded on an engine mount, flat plate, and I made this jack shaft for it. And you just got a regular centrifugal clutch on it now, and it works pretty good. So the gear ratio is pretty low; it's like nine, nine to one ish. So it doesn't go slow; it goes fast. But 
got bigger tires in the back, like 18 inch, so it works out okay. And here's my other go kart. I it had the 175cc two-stroke Yamaha on it, and that hasn't been on it for years. I just had this had the go kart laying around without the engine, so I put this eight horse Tecumseh on it and the torque converter, and put a little bit bigger sprocket on it for better gear ratio. And it's not as fast as the other one was, but it works alright. It's a lot nicer having the automatic transmission than the manual one.